Hi, my name is Karen Fairhurst. I'm with the Midwest Implant, Implant Institute. We have China Holland and Dr. Robert Heller here. We're going to show you what has worked for us for decades with drawing the blood to create PRP and PRF. You can see over here on the counter, we have our blood draw tube, we have our red tubes that are empty that we'll make our a PRF with, we have alcohol pad that we're going to clean the area with, we have our vacutainer holder, we have two yellow tubes that have the calcium chloride in them to um, uh, stop the blood from coagulating so we can get our PRP. We have what we prefer, which is a 24 gauge catheter and a band-aid and our stress ball and our tourniquet. I'm going to hand all these items to China to help her do the blood draw. China's going to take Dr. Heller's arm and she's going to make her best choice on a site to draw the blood. Now, not everybody is like Dr. Heller, and you can throw a dart from out in the hall and, and find a good vein. He's got several good choices here. Um, that one right there is kind of rolly, so that's not going to be China's choice. And she's looking, and I think she's found her vein. So now I'm going to step back. I'm going to open up the alcohol. So I'm going to hand China an alcohol swab. She's going to cleanse the area. I'm going to open up the catheter, loosen it, and hand it to her. She's going to turn the bevel so that it's up. Now I'm going to open our vacutainer holder. China's advancing the catheter. We'll pull out the needle. She'll release the tourniquet. She's going to compress so that the blood doesn't flow out. And then I'm just going to gently place that on there, and then she's going to tighten that down. We have a sharps container right back here. I'm going to toss that right in there. Now, we, these have to get into the centrifuge immediately. These are the PRF tubes. I'm going to hand her one of these first. You want to hand it with the label down so that they can see the blood filling the tube. And sometimes this can take a long time, especially if your patient is sedated. And if you have a vein like we have here, it's uh, going pretty quick. So then it's key. You can see how China has a firm hold on the vacutainer holder. That's key to maintaining your flow and not bending your catheter. Some other things that we found is um, if you don't get that vacutainer holder tightly on the catheter that you get some bubbles. Kind of a small little study we've done in here in the office. We feel like we don't get as good of a PRF um, when we see the bubblies. So I have two of these now. This is going to be balanced. So we're going to start this right away. This is set on two and a half. We're going to go in 15 minutes, and that's going to start spinning. Now I'm going to hand China the yellow tube. And that's filled, and then I'm going to pass her the other yellow tube. Now we have to have these balanced, so I'm not going to open this up yet to put these in. We need to get these in as soon as possible so we get our best PRF. Now I'm going to get our band aid ready while I'm waiting for that to fill. And we twist these a couple of times just to make sure everything mixes up well. This is going to twist. Well, China will then use a two by two 
and apply pressure. I'm going to open this up, shut it off. There's a button over here to open. You got to wait till it stops. While I'm waiting for that, I'm going to give China the band aid here. And this is completely stopped. Now I can press this button. And we put these opposite each other. Press the lid down. Put this back to 15. Now we wait for our blood to spin. 